Wolfgang. Amadeus Mozart. The man you accuse yourself of killing. You've heard that? Is it true? For God's sake, my son. If you have something to confess, do it now. Give yourself some peace. You was my idol. Mozart. I can't think of a time when I didn't know his name. While well, my father prayed earnestly to God to protect commerce, I would offer up secretly the proudest prayer a boy could think of. Lord, make me a great composer. Let me celebrate your glory through music and be celebrated myself. Make me famous through the world, dear God. Make me immortal. After I die, let people speak my name forever with love for what I wrote. In return, I will give you my chastity, my industry, deepest humility. Just a, just a trifle, of course. I've written a little march of welcome in his honor. This is yours. Keep it, Majesty, if you want. It's already here in my head. What? On one hearing only? I think so, sire. Yes. Show us. this. This. Yes. Better? What do you think? My, my sincere congratulations. Did you like it, then? How could I not? What was God up to? Was it possible I was being tested? Was God expecting me to offer forgiveness in the face of every offense, no matter how painful? It's very possible. But why him? Why choose Mozart to teach me lessons in humility? My heart was filling up with such hatred for that little man. For the first time in my life, I began to know really violent thoughts. 
every day. Sometimes for hours I would pray. Lord, please, send him away. Back to Salzburg. For his sake. As well as mine. 